I might run into you. You look like you could use this. Oh, thank you. Um, Fair Samantha went to fetch me a refreshing libation, but she had more pressing matters to attend to. Do you need some help? Oh, uh, yeah, just uh, keep a lookout for anything that seems out of place. Okay. So I take it you haven't heard from Maxie? Only the report of her smashed car. She's, you know, probably got a ride into town or something. She's fine. But surely she would have gotten word to someone by now. I doubt it. She's probably safe at home soaking in a bubble bath. I just wonder where Johnny is. Was it kind of me to supply Lucky Spencer with pills so he would sleep with me? I can't believe you need drugs for that. Was it generous to make sure Elizabeth would walk in on it? Let's not forget about all the crap I put Lulu through when Logan was around. I mean, I've been doing stuff like this for years. Hey, Maxie, who yelled at me when I wouldn't go see Lulu with Shady Book? <laughs> That's because she was pathetic, begging to see you, and it was depressing. Okay. When Lulu was finally allowed visitors, who was the first person there? Someone had to see when she was planning on coming back to work. Right. Anyway, if I've done anything remotely decent, it's because of Spinelli. You've been good for him, too. I don't think so. Oh, come on, Maxie. You respect him, you defend him, you are kind to him when a lot of people are anything but. Most women wouldn't even speak to a guy like Spinelli. Except Winifred. I don't think you have anything to worry about. How can he even look at her after she turned him into the FBI? Oh, forget about that. You being friends with Spinelli is probably one of the best things that ever happened to him. I know that's true for me. And whether you care to admit it or not, you've been a pretty good friend of Lulu. Maybe so. But let's be honest. If it wasn't for your sudden weird attack of nobility, you and I would be doing it right this second. <laughs> We're just playing chicken, that's all. Speak for yourself. You wouldn't have gone through with it any more than I would have. Would you? I guess you'll never know. Yeah, we should get out of here. Is the <clears throat> snow still coming down? Yeah, it is. But I don't like the way I left things with Lula. Don't tell me you're starting to feel guilty. I'm gonna dig up some snow chains, put them on the cart. Okay. And we'll get back to town. It's a close one. That almost happened between us. Too close. But I question all these people, you know? I'm sure that they found Maxie and they just can't get the call through. Perhaps. Lulu, aren't you supposed to be helping Epiphany? Uh, Epiphany said that I could sit here and look at security footage with Spinelli. Is that the jackal? Spinelli, it's Jax. Is Carly around? Ah, uh, yeah. Uh, Valkyrie, tis your white knight. I was nice in you. Without hope, there is nothing. I wanted it to be Johnny. I'm sure that we will hear from them soon, and I'm sure they're both fine.